Hello and welcome. I'm going to show you how you can handle situations like these where you have clips divided by space on multiple tracks and obviously you want them to connect but moving all this around is quite tedious. Please take note this is for KDN Live 1608.3. Changes sometimes change the location of menu items or names of buttons, stuff like that. So check the description for any notes for our versions and maybe even check the comments. Let, let us know in the comments if something doesn't work in your version. So what we want is ripple delete. Unfortunately this doesn't exist. We would want to be able to right click here and say ripple delete this emptiness and then what would happen is these things would move like this. But we can't do that. Instead we have the option to remove space which only works on one track. So if everything was on one track, that might be okay. We could just click remove space multiple times and that would be fine. But with this project, this doesn't work. So what options do we have? One thing we can do is use the timeline removal extract timeline zone option. In older versions, it is in the All Clips menu item here. And what it does is, it we can use it with Shift X. What we can do is we can go to the end of a clip or the beginning of an emptiness or space, press I for in, use Alt key and right to jump to the end of this space or emptiness, press O for out, and now this blue highlighted area will be deleted when we press Shift X like this except you have to click on the timeline once now. So yeah, you have to do quite a few steps before it works. And shift, no, alt left, I, alt right, alt right, O, click, shift X. But this works rather reliably right now. Now we go back and I will show you one more option, which, which I personally prefer. For this, we switch to the spacer tool. You can also press M and make sure that snap is enabled down here. And now you can just drag this here. Okay, that's normal. But if you drag this one, everything on the right side of it will also be dragged. And then we can drag all of these as well. Make sure to make, put your uh, playhead out of the way. Now let's try this again, but let's assume that there's some music on another track. If we press M now and try to drag this, we can only drag to the right side because the music wants to occupy the space as well because it exists on the left and on the right side of where I'm starting to drag. To avoid this, we can just lock the channel, the track, and now we can continue as before. So these are my tricks on how to handle spaces and moving multiple clips on different tracks at the same time. If you have any other ideas, please write a comment. This is actually a huge deal for me because being able to move clips and removing space quickly is really crucial to a lot of projects that I'm working on. So thanks for watching, check out my other tutorials, please like and subscribe and see you in the next video. Ciao!